Hello my friends, thanks for stopping by. Hope you're all having a great day. Today I'm going to share with you my October empties in the middle of November, I'm sure of it. <laughs> um, happy birthday to all my November babies. I know that many people have the same birthday as me, November 10th. I will turn 58 years old and my heart and mind do not feel it. My body, however, some days does let me know, hey, you. 58 years you've been walking on these bones. Take it easy. <laughs> but anywhere, anyway, life is good. So we are going to get on to my empties. Uh, most of these I finished up. Louie has only helped me with a couple of items. But first I'm going to start off with uh, a product that I've been using for years. And this is by Colorproof. And this is their uh, super rich moisture condition. Many will ask me, well, aren't you still using the Monate? I use the Monate, Monate products on my scalp. And and Louis uses the products on everything, but for me, the Monate is not enough moisture for my ends. So I use the shampoo and the oils on my scalp, but I do use my, uh, some of my other styling products and conditioners on the ends of my hair, not on my scalp. But I find that the Monate are not enough for my type of hair. So uh, I still use my Colorproof and I also used up the Super Rich Daily Intensive Moisture Treatment. This I just throw on in the shower on the end ends, the very ends, and I will just leave it, and I use it a couple of times a week, uh, and I leave it on the ends just to add some extra moisture to the ends. I do like these products and I will get both of them again while we're on shampoo. Louie actually fin finished up the Monate Black Shampoo and Conditioner, another one. He loves this stuff, absolutely loves it. And it's made a big difference in him. He has a ton of hair growth. I don't see new growth, but I do see a difference in my scalp health. I will tell you one thing that I have truly noticed is I do not have flaking on my, my scalp anymore, anymore. I used to have a lot of dry, flaky skin on my scalp, not anymore. But anyway, the two-in-one is one of Louis's favorites, and he also likes the intensive repair because they both have 30% of the ingredients that actual, actually help with regrowth. So that's Louis. Uh, for me, I tried this out because Al is for living said you must try the Trader Joe's shave cream. So I did, and Al, I like it. And I have to say, I don't have another, I thought I finished up the other one. I usually do the Alba. I don't think there's any difference in these, so I don't know which one costs less, but either whichever one costs less is the one you should go for because I really don't see any difference. They actually are in the same type of package, coloring, everything. But I will say this was honey mango, and it was very nice, and I would get it again. It is paraben-free and 100% vegetarian. So thank you, Al. Um, this came, Joelle actually had sent me some products a long time ago, and this was a free gift, and she stuck, she put it in my box, and I have to say I love it. It's Caudalie's uh, Shower Gel. It's non-irritating, soap-free. I think what I loved about it most is the smell. I love it, but I do love the Caudalie products. So I would get this again, but I'm not going to get it with my VIB. Uh, I already told you guys that I'm getting the cream, the lotion, and the scrub. Love it. So let's start this. Well, that's a fail, so we're going to save that to last, my friends. All right, so I finished up a NIOD. This is their Super Oxide Dismutase Saccharide Mist. I love this. I will order it again. I think they've actually added more yeast into the formula, so it's a little bit different in color now. I love it. I love it. I spritzed it on after a toner. I love this product by NIOD. I don't know why. I just absolutely love it, and I'm going to get more of it. I felt that it really helped with the moisture barrier of my skin. All right, so I finished up a Kerastase. This is their Elixir Ultime. I have to say, I absolutely love this product on my wet hair. I think the shine that I get is incredible. Again, I use it only on the ends of my hair. I don't use any oils or anything else on my scalp except for the Rejuvenique, but I'm not one, unless I'm doing a deep treatment with something, then I will, but on a daily basis, it will weigh my hair down. So I only use it on the ends. The shine is incredible that you get from this. Love, love, love it. So I will get that again. 
And then I finished up this, I'm gonna save that to last too because I didn't really love that either. Okay, this is from Kiehl's and I just used, uh, purchased these from Michelle. I purchased, uh, I think two or three more of each. Love these. This is by Kiehl's, it's their Creme Decor Smoothing Oil to Foam Body Cleanser. This is wonderful for my gator friends. Very, very nourishing to the skin. I love the dry oil too. Absolutely beautiful. I already have backups. I'm on my second bottle of it. Love it. It has a... The smell I'm not crazy about. It doesn't really smell like the lotion to me, but it's not, it's not obnoxious that I'm going to stop using it. Absolutely love it. It has a wonderful, very creamy lather. And when you rinse, you can still feel that you're moist. I don't feel dry or tight after using it at all. All right, so uh, the Moroccan oil uh, hydration mask, I love. I go and through tons of masks because I will throw a mask on any chance I get. Any chance I get. If I'm cleaning dry hair, I'll just throw a mask on the end, wrap it up in a top knot, and leave it in my hair. My hair doesn't even have to be damp for me to throw a mask on. Um, I love hair masks. I've been using them for years. I am a firm believer if you are going to be an aging woman especially, but any woman, and you are going to wear long hair, you must care for it. If you walk around with fried hair, you are adding 10 years to your head. And I think that's where this silly little notion came from or silly little belief came from that women over 40 should chop their hair. I think because in the olden days, they didn't take care of their hair the way we can. Although we use harsher chemicals. I mean, well, we don't use harsher chemicals. We use harsher tools on our hair. Um, but I am just, I mean, really get some mask, my friends. They don't have to be expensive masks, and you will see an improvement in your hair. I swear, you will. Okay, so I finished up that, and yes, I will get it again. I already have it. I finished up the Jane Iridell H2O Mist. Love this. Love it. It's very hydrating. It's wonderful over makeup or just on your plain face. I really like the Jane Iridell line. I think it's one of those sleeper lines that needs to come out of the... Uh, covers from under the covers because it's pretty good stuff. It really is. All right. So I did do some, um, I'm actually going to stop using these, um, because my skin is not responding to them anymore the way they did. Um, these are the Dr. Dennis Gross alpha beta peel. Um, these are very good, but my skin, and I think it's due to menopause. Uh, I'm going through some changes with my skin and, um, these just aren't rewarding to me anymore. Um, they worked so well for me for so long. The changes that my skin is going through, thats it's just not liking them anymore. I actually get like a little breakout every time I use one of these, but I will use them up on my chest and stuff because I'm not having a problem. The sun is actually coming out. We have had rain for days and it's been like 40 degrees with the rain. And when you have two doodles that are puppies with lots of energy and they're very furry little creatures and you have a very large yard that is really wet on one side of it and mud puddles are there. Mm. It's not a good combination for me. I said to Lou, 16 more days, we get our vacation <laughs> from the doodles. <laughs> I love them. I love them. They are very, very, very um, sweet dogs, but boy, are they higher energy and are they destructive? Well, Lula is not so much destructive. Lula is uh, a very gentle, calm, very, um, she's, she's going to be my affectionate one. I can tell Harley is very aloof, almost dopey and, um, carefree, just really. And she Harley cannot sit down. Harley will pace for hours. She will just keep going and going, even if she's had an hour of walking and she's been outside playing for a couple of hours because Harley doesn't go outside and lay down. Harley is on the go from the time you let her out in a crate in the morning until the time you put her in her crate. So I, I'm trying, um, I, I, I want her I, rose I, into some calmness. I mean, her pacing, I just think how enjoyable could that be? I couldn't imagine being a human being just pacing around like crazy all the time. 
Anyway, let's get back to my empties. Uh, I also finished uh, some of the Lancome eye mask. I do like these. Um, won't get them again right now because I have so many masks and I'm trying to use things up. That's my new law. It's not a rule. It's the law in this house. I must finish things up. All right, so, okay, so I'm going to save the last few items because those were not, they didn't, they're not going to make it back into my cart on any shopping spree. But I will tell you, of everything that I have finished up here, my most favorite, favorite, favorite item has been this. And I do have another bottle, and it's really expensive, but it's so phenomenal. I would say, say save your money for as long as it takes and treat yourself to a bottle of this because it is so beautiful. And I had this bottle for a while. You do not you need to overuse this. You really only need this if you're one of those people that doesn't like to really layer a lot of skincare or buy a lot of different products. But it is pricey, my friends. And that is the Vintner's Oil. I have never used anything like this oil. I love the smell of it. I love the way my skin feels with it. I love the way makeup lays over it. I have not been dry since using it. Uh, my face has normalized. Uh, by now, I get I have dry patches and peeling with the weather changes. And this has just been the best oil I have ever used on my face. So my friends, the Vintner's oil is very expensive, but uh, you know, Christmas, I don't know. Phenomenal. All right. Now, products that I did not like. If you remember a while back, I talked about the, this is the same concept as Monate, but this is by Colorproof. And you know that I adore Colorproof products. I really do. I mean, I just bought their mousse, uh, their brand new product. I love the Colorproof line. But this left my hair feeling like absolute straw. And I did give away, I did do a giveaway with this. And I would really like to know of the people that I sent this to, um, did you have the same experience with it? Did, was it drying? Um, this, I don't know what it is. They just have not perfected these types of products for the strands of hair. They all are a little drying to me, but they work wonderful on the scalp. Now, I can't say how this worked on the scalp because I just, after a few days of using it, my hair was like, brittle. It was terrible. So I couldn't use this. And I apologize to those of you who won this from me and if it did the same to you. Okay. All right. So the next product, these were also, um, this is by Belif and this is their cleansing gel enriched oil. I didn't like this. I didn't like anything about it. I used it all up, but I didn't like it. I didn't feel clean after it. I didn't like it. Not at all. Um, I would say pass on this unless you're using it and it's working for you. But um, it it didn't remove all my makeup. You know, I try things on clean face and dry face so that I'm able to see, well, does this remove makeup or doesn't it? Um, this didn't remove all my makeup and it did not me leave me feeling moisturized or anything like that. And this thing here, this it's skin conditioning agent, has emollients, but it has none of the garbage in it that it's supposed to have. And it's with sweet, sweet flag, winter melon seeds, Napier's original formula. The number represents percentage of ingredients added. So it has 56% of this product is an emollient and 38% is a skin conditioning agent and camera. And I don't have a battery pack. Uh, electric one for this camera. I'm trying to find one, but I can't. I have one for my other one, so I never have to worry about a battery. With this one, uh, the battery dies out on me. So I was just saying that never again will I buy this one. Okay. And then the last thing that I was truly disappointed in, and you know that I like the Shea Moisture products, is the Shea Moisture Shave. Ugh, it's just terrible. I can't even say anything good about it. It's, um, it's messy. And it's like a whipped foam. So because it's a whipped foam, I have to remember when my eyes 
look away from the camera. It will focus on behind me and it will go blurry. So I have to remember that when I look down at something, it's not seeing my eyes. So it's going to focus and blur out. So I apologize. I'm trying to learn all these new tricks. Uh, anyway, I would not get this again. It was a, a like a whipped foam. It didn't stay on the skin where, you know, the Trader's Joe, once you rub and massage it in, it leaves this beautiful layer on the skin and you just shave over it and you get a really nice sh uh, close shave. I did not with that. So I would not buy that. Oh, I did it again. I would not buy that again, my friends. So that is my bucket of empties. And I love having empties. It just makes me feel good to know that I'm going through things now. Look at me. I'm throwing it in, not taking my eyes off of you. Um, because I am looking at each and every one of you. Yes, I am. Anyway, uh, that's it for me. That's my empties. What did you finish up this month? Do you try new things? Are you disappointed with them? Um, tell us some of the things that you tried that you're disappointed in and why. Um, and also some of the things you love because with the negative, we like to hear the positive. Okay. So thanks for stopping by. Don't forget to subscribe. We're just living life. Go out in the world and be happy, healthy, beautiful, and most of all, my friends, lovable. I love you all. Bisous.